the entire world said that this fight could never happen, and that's why I set it up. That's why I tried to make it happen. Um, there was so much against both of you going into this. The, the entire internet said, Wings, you never get on a plane. He did get on a plane. He is here. The entire internet said that Boogie wouldn't pass the medicals. He did that, and he is also here. Boogie, 290. Yeah, round of applause. This is 800 pounds in one ring. Boogie, why did you decide to do something different with your career and take on a fight like this? Well, well first, I just want to say to Jordy, thank you for taking on this 1v1. I know you're not a big fan of him. Uh, thanks for coming out of retirement to do that. I mean, you say this, but I've never backed down from a 1v1. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. But well, I, I just wanted to say that, um, honestly, I kind of needed the money. I, if if I had not done this fight, I might have ended up living in my car. But at least you and I would both have houses with wheels on it, Jordy, so that we had that in common. You know. You know, at least my house is paid for, but but. <laughs> but, but I just, I'll be honest with you, man. I, Keemstar reached out to me not too long ago, and he's like, dude, let me pay you to get fit. Let me pay you to change your life. Let me pay you to get your ass out of your rut of misery that you created for yourself. And I took him up on the opportunity, man. And it's taken six years after my bypass surgery to get to this point. It's taken, I cannot tell you how much therapy, how many psychedelics. Like, I've gone through hell to get to this point. And I, I will say, here's the thing that Jordy's really got to deal with, okay? He might win by decision, but there's no way he's putting me on my ass. I can promise you that. I've taken worse beatings when I was eight. I've seen a flight of stairs uh, give you a beating today. Oh, you yeah, make it to the yeah. end of the rap. Yeah, all right. But then, you, you know you're the favorite going to this fight. You got the height on me. You got the reach on me. You got the age on me. You got everything else. But I win by being here. Do you understand you, you that? Best I too. win by being here. You already lost. This is your last chance. Just like so many other people chose to ride my coattails, you get to ride them one last time, man. You know, your career ended because you refused to go on a camping trip, and soon you're going to be living in a fucking tent. Mm. Wings, are you going to take this? I mean, it's a lot of talk from, from Boogie, but the internet and most people think you have an edge here. How does this change your fight? Are you really going to take them down round one? Oh, I'm trying to get him out in 30 seconds. Like, honestly. Like, he had, like, he's got bad knees. He's got no hips. He's got no movement. Like, like honestly, I've seen a flight of stairs that they almost take this man completely I out. wake up in more pain than you're going to put me through. Do you understand that? I wake up in more pain you wake every up in pain single day. You nothing with blunt force trauma, my man. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, Boogie, you had mentioned to me in a, in a Twitter space, you said, you know, you're a nice guy, you don't like beefing with uh, people normally, but when it comes to wings, you know, that's someone you could really slap around and punch him hard in the head. What makes it about wings that you don't like him, that you're ready to get in the ring and really do some damage? Man, I'll just be honest with you, I'm done treating him like a person. He's just an obstacle in between where I need to go and what I need to do. An I, obstacle, dog? I've seen you busting down sweating, getting interviews over there. What yeah, are you I'm good about at sweating, obstacle? fool. I'm good at sweating, okay? I flew 20 hours. I got off a plane. I came here. You act like I, I didn't do the moving. same shit. I was in a wheelchair six years ago, Jordy. I was in a wheelchair, all right? I stood through two hours of interviews. That's pretty goddamn good. Oh, my Lord. You were in a wheelchair. You're going to be in a wheelchair Sunday. It doesn't matter. You just Oh, yeah, yeah. This. You know, I, I destroyed my wheelchair to make sure that I didn't need it. A lot of people said I should donate it. I know who's going well, to need it come Sunday, Jordy. The airport has that little wheelie thing that they can push you along. You just got to tip them. <laughs> Jordy, you're a joke. You're a joke. A lot of people come, are tuning into this, you know, to laugh, all right? There's one person to laugh at. There's actually one low cow here. I'm YouTube royalty. You are YouTube never was. I might be a has-been. You never were, brother. You know, it's funny because you used to talk about how you were so smart in investing your money, and we sit here today, and you're penniless. You're taking a fight against a man that's 15 years younger than you. You have no chance against me. You're taking a fight with a man who's 15 years younger than you. I ain't afraid of you. I ain't afraid of you. You eat it like milk. You can't do anything to me my mom didn't do to me when I was eight. Wings, what did you have to do to prepare for this fight? Because, you know, even though you think it's going to be easy, you haven't been training like it's going to be easy. You've been putting a lot of work and effort in. Can you talk about that? 
Well, like there's always there's always a puncher's chance in any kind of boxing match. You you can make one mistake and you know momentum can take over and you can get put lights out. I didn't want to get embarrassed, and I was in terrible shape when I took this fight, and only had like six weeks to actually get ready for it. And I don't I'm not going to sit and pretend that I'm a boxer in any shape or form, but I lost, I dropped 36 pounds. I I basically increased my cardio. I've walked 20.1 miles since I've been here in London. You know, I've been trying to stay on top of everything. I've, I've kicked soda for the most part. I've been watching my things, taking multivitamins. I mean, this helped get my life turned around because I was in a bad spot heading nowhere. The pun is intended for this fight. This is redemption. If you walk away with the win, Wings, what do you do? What's next? What changes in your life? Oh, shit. I don't really know about that answer. <laughs> I'll take it to Boogie. Same question. What changes in my life? No changes. I keep getting better. I keep getting stronger. I keep doing my job. I keep entertaining people. Do you invest That's in cryptocurrency? That's what I keep doing. Oh, shut the fuck up. Do you invest right. more in cryptocurrency? I've been, path, I've been on a path since I've been on YouTube in 2006. My first video was me eating french fries. I have lost 200 pounds. I've gotten my mobility back. I've entertained millions of people, 4 million subscribers, and that just number is going to keep going up. I'm going to keep You're doing everything I can with to live the progress. best life I can. Nothing changes. I'm already on that path like a fucking bullet, son. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, May 13th, the prelims. All four of these fights will be streamed for absolutely free over on the Misfit Boxing YouTube channel starting at 5 p.m. local time, noon Eastern. I'm excited. Pat God, final thoughts on this. Dude, some of these fights are legendary. Like, have you guys ever seen a fight like this? I mean, come on, let's hear it for them. This is history right here. Come on. I, I dreamed of this moment, and it's finally, finally happening. Boogie, uh, to end this thing out, if you could get up here, do a face-to-face -face with Wings. No, I got we, got, we got security ready? Hold on. <laughs> he ain't going by himself now. Where's Chip? We need Chip. There was a race to the center. Wings won that. In the middle. <laughs> Oh, this is tense. Here we go. Did you drink it? What, did you drink, drink it? it? Did you drink my Mountain Dew? Uh, oh, did you drink it? Did you? <laughs> You're a big man. You're a big man. You're, oh, <laughs> son, son, uh, do not, do not make it. I'm not the problem. Do not. <laughs> you got enough of that. Okay. Bro, bro. Everybody, get it. Oh. <laughs> 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 Take your shirt off, champ! You're a joke. You're a joke. No. Oh. Tarps off. You deserve. Tarps off. You deserve the phrase. Flex like something. Huh? <laughs> oh my god. Every day. Flex on it. I have actual fans of there. You know who watches you? People watch you to laugh. That's who watches you. I have actual fans in this audience right now. Okay. Yeah. Where, where are they sponsors at? Huh? I don't oh. need him, Jordy. I don't live in a fucking trailer. I don't live in a fucking trailer. I don't need a sponsor. <laughs> get him out of there, Boogie. Okay, talk We're going to get him out of there. Ladies and gentlemen, Woo! Boogie 2988 versus Wings of Redemption. It's